It's always like the worst thing to walk past somebody and they just stink and you just be like, dang, did you take a shower last night? Cause you be so funky. If you wasn't really there for me at the heart, he said that's all you had to say, yo. That's all you had. What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, it's Baby J, and I'm back with another video. In today's video, I'm going to do a middle school advice, as you can tell by the title. Like, at the top. Yeah, that right there. Make sure y'all have y'all listening ears on. Because y'all gonna need to hear this. Because I'm finna spit some game. I'm just kidding. But anyways, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Because, like, that's the most important thing to do while you're watching this video. Is subscribe and make sure you thumbs up this video. If you like more videos like this, then comment below. And, yeah, don't forget to subscribe, subscribe, and subscribe. Because, and don't forget to click that bell. Because you will get notified every time I post. So, yeah, let's get into this video. Okay, yeah, so I wanted to honestly say, I am going to the A grade, so I feel like I can, like, help y'all a little bit. It really don't matter, but if y'all want to take these tips, don't forget to stay tuned. Alright, y'all, so the first tip I have for y'all is learn how to open your locker. Okay, so if you have any gym classes, you probably will, because I think, it depends on what grade. I think everybody fucks that gym, I don't know. Mm. But anyways, learn how to open your locker if you have like a locker for like gym stuff. Because I tell you, that stuff be hard. Like, but that stuff is hard to figure out. So you might want to learn how to do that. So yeah, the next tip I have for you guys is do not be in no drama, bro. These people is messy. Don't be trying to spare rumors. Don't try to do none of that because you want to stay drama free. If you want to live a happy life, don't be in drama. Okay. Do not be in that mess. Okay. So. Stay out of that drama and focus on your tip I have for y'all is do not run in the hallways. Like you have enough time to get this class, but my I'm not gonna be with that y'all. My school they be like that you have five minutes. That is not no five minutes in between classes. I swear to god, I feel like it's like thirty seconds. Like and then the teacher wanna hold you, that is so frustrating. Like don't hold me if you know I gotta be in this class and then they be trying to lock you out. Like this this stuff is annoying. So, you know, just don't run in the hallway. You might want to, like, speed walk or something. But try to run in the hallway because I hate when people run in the hallway and they bump into me. I be like, what is you doing? Like, you know, just don't run in the hallway, you know, for safety issues also. Okay, the next one that I have for y'all is do not stop in the hallway. You know how frustrating it is to somebody, you walk in and somebody just instantly stop. Like, I do that. I can't even, I be doing that sometimes. But I know, like. Just for advice, y'all should not stop in the hallway because, like, if y'all have a lot of kids in y'all school, everybody just trying to get to the places. If you just stop in the hallway, like, what is you doing? What is you doing? Right? And next thing I have for y'all is you do not need all that materials. Like, you do not need to come with the bag. You know, that one student that come with their backpack filled with supplies. Like, what is you doing? But they do be having all their supplies, and I do be asking them for some of their stuff. But it's like, you don't need all that much. Like, you just need some pencils, like, a couple of notebooks and stuff like that. Nothing yeah, so the mind. next tip is for you guys is do not try to prove yourself to no one. Don't try to prove yourself to no one. Because especially if you like going to sixth grade, people will try to like make you like feel like you gotta prove yourself to them or like try to test your patience. Just don't feed into it. Just be like, all right, you know. I don't know how some people are, but just don't feed into no stuff, okay? Just don't feed into it. And stay with like, say if you go into middle school, like, it's okay to make friends in sixth grade, kind of, like, if you were in, a, in like, middle school, you can't even make friends, but do not try to have a lot of friends. I mean, if you're just that type of person to have a lot of friends, then good for you, but a lot of friends means a lot of drama and, you know, a lot of mess, because sometimes people like to talk and, you know, so if I was you, I would try to stick with, like, certain type of friends, don't try to mingle. Like, you can mingle, but don't be trying to, like, you know how it's that one person that always trying to be in everybody's friend, but then it seems like they always everybody drama because they have so many friends, they so-called friends. Like, it's just, like, try to be, try to have, like, at least three or four good friends and try to stick with them. Don't try to make friends with every single body in the school because, like, yeah. This one is take good care of your body, like. Have good hygiene, bro. You may want to bring you some, like, deodorant stuff because, you know, it is just the worst thing ever to walk past somebody and they just stink. And you just be like, dang, did you take a shower last night? Because you be so funky. But just take it just in case, like, you come from gym and you, like, you know, you must, you know, yeah, you, you know, you got to fix your shit, but, you know. So it's good to have good hygiene because I'm not going to lie, people will talk about you. So make sure you, make sure you, make 
you got your stuff together. All right, y'all, so next tip is make sure y'all, like, if I was y'all, like, if I was coming into being in school, I would try to be cool with some of my teachers. You always want to have that one teacher you good with because, let me tell you, that one teacher going to help you out in the long run because you always want to have, like, try to get to know your teachers. Like, you don't have to be cool with every single teacher, but try to just have one or two teachers that you know, like, they, like, y'all, you look at them as not just a teacher, you know? So just, so, like, just have that bond, okay? Just get a bond, you know? The next one is join sports. I know in my um school, middle school, you can um uh, play sports in sixth grade, but like I think you could do like music stuff or something like that. But like if you're in seventh grade, eighth grade, or something like that, make sure you try to get in sports. So in high school, you can kind of like you know have something to do basically, and it's like it make you. I feel like sports make you want to do better in school because you know. Or to play sports, you have to have good grades and stuff like that. And plus, like, that's a good way. I'm not going to lie. It's like, if you, like, play sports and you get more, like, people know you. Like, you know that? You know, like, if you play sports, like, everyone's going to know you if you're good. I mean, <laughs> if you like you're good, you know, that's a good way just to, like, you know. That's your friends. <laughs> Do you guys' homework, you know? I know it's like, but when I got to, like, okay, so when I was in elementary, we really didn't have homework like that. But, like, when I got to sit and stuff, like, you know, I have different homework from different classes. So, like, I used to be up trying to help her do my homework. Like, it was so rushed. Like, I used to stay rushing, doing my homework in the morning. Like, do your homework at night, you know, when you get it. You might want to do it extra time because, like, I ain't going to lie. Like, it is, like, sometimes you do get frustrated when you have a lot of homework. But, like, just do it because... It's going to help you in the long run. Lastly, don't be worried about being popular or whatever. Or I've known. But, like, it's, like, okay. But basically, what I was saying earlier, like, don't try to, like, prove yourself to people. But, like, don't try to be, like, try to, like, just try to be, like, if you're popular, then you're popular. If you're not, then not. Don't try to be known, basically, is what I'm saying. So, yeah. Hey, guys, so, that was all for this video. If you guys enjoyed, don't forget to subscribe. And do not leave this video without subscribing because, like, yeah, and don't forget to turn on that bell. It's right by when you subscribe. Don't forget to so you get notified every time I post. And comment below video ideas. And also check the poll. I'm trying to see what kind of name I should call you guys. So check the poll. And yeah, see you guys in my next video. Peace.